Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to a brand new Let's Play. If you saw the title of the Let's Play, you know what we're getting into, but today we are getting into our first ever walkthrough, and my first ever walkthrough, of Donkey Kong Country. It has a very cool intro, I like the, the old Kong here, up playing the music box. And then we get the intro, Donkey Kong jumping in. The old man yelling at him. And this is very, very old school Nintendo stuff here. TNT box, and then Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong there, swinging, trying to get across the thing. And it came out in 1994 by Nintendo, obviously. And then it just replaced that intro over and over again, but... Here we get to select a game. I'm playing one player here on my end, so I'm just going to go ahead and select the one player. I already cracked my soda pop, but usually I would do a, a soda pop, but here we're in the jungle. It doesn't show it in this game, but what happened here is somebody stole our, our horde bananas. So let's make our way on through. And I gotta say, um, this game... Just because, like I said, I like to get like a bunch of these done ahead of time. So like I'm already recording episode 3 and 4 as this is coming out. And um, man, like this is nothing like a Mario game. I don't understand who played this as a kid. This, To me, the platforming in this game is so extremely challenging. And I can't really explain why. Like it, it's just really difficult for whatever reason. So with that being said, of course, I am going to have... There are going to be some save points and things like that that you see throughout here. You know, as levels get more frustrating and things like that. But, you know, try to bear with me. Like I said, for me, this is extremely challenging. It looks like we found a secret here. Just lots of bananas hidden here. Always nice when in the first episode we can find a secret and get an extra life out of it. That's always a nice add-on. And there we can get the G... So that gives us an extra life, too, because we were able to spell Kong. It looks like this rhino guy is just really good at beating enemies, which is always a nice add-on there. Let's get into the, the exit. Do our happy dance. And you can see I'm struggling here, but I am going to create a save point. Um, I'm going to try and cut these out as much as I can. Although it is going to be challenging. And here we go. Moving into the next one. Now we got these armadillo guys. Looks like you could either hit them twice or jump on them. And that will defeat them. We got these guys up the top up here. Let's get the K. Throw this at this armadillo. <coughs> Excuse me. There we go. Let's get out of his way. Man, it's storming. Like episode two and we're... It seems like we're already in the stormy downward spiral here. Swinging from our vines. Let's get over here. And I do, yeah, I'm sure you've noticed, um, I want to keep these episodes really, really short. Number one, like I said, it's a very frustrating game for myself, so that obviously adds an element of wanting to keep it short. And then, um, number two, you know, it's like the it's the Christmas season, things like that. Everybody's got a lot going on. So uh, instead of rushing to get episodes out, it's nice to like take the time and just do this in a nice way, I guess is the best way to put it. But let's see. Looks like we need to make that jump, but that jump looks dangerous. Okay, we didn't have to make it. Probably would have been nice to make it, but that's all right. Land on this guy. Probably could have went right to the vine there, but like I said, I'd rather be safe than sorry. I think those bees, there's like no way to deal with them ever. Like, you, you just die if you touch them. That's all that happens. And then that arrow usually means that the exit is like right around here. So let's see if we could find an exit. Okay, it looks like there is one right there, but the G in Kong is up the top there. I think I would have had a bounce off the top of that guy's head. Oh no, there's a barrel down here. I could probably use the barrel. No, that just like leads us to a secret, it looks like. Oh yes, and this one is uh... a... 
so I didn't realize, I thought like whichever one we picked there was gonna be the decision. But we do get a second here to run around and pick the barrel we actually want. I'm gonna go with that one just, yeah, cause I wasn't paying attention to where it went. I thought we had to pick it ahead of time, but Diddy Kong is gonna step on his hat in frustration there. Then we're gonna come back down. Let's see, do we get another shot at getting this end piece here? The ending G. I think we'd have to jump on this guy. Yeah, but he sort of went with us. Maybe we could jump on... Yeah, we could jump on this thing and get the, the G there. So get an extra life out of that. That's very nice. Always nice when we get those opportunities. Let's do our happy dance. It's a little bit less happy with good old Donkey Kong not being there. Here's old man Kong. I think he's just giving us... Cronky Kong, that's what they call him. I think he's just giving us some pointers in how to play the game. Now we just need to go straight down and we could work on our last level of this episode. Like I said, I want to make it like really clean cut. Just a couple episodes per level, like one little section like this. And that should put us at a boss every two, every two levels. Or every two episodes, which should keep it entertaining. And um, yeah, it should also keep it like relatively stress free, which is big this time of year. It's difficult to... I wanted to play a new game that was going to be... You know, we're playing Pokemon right now, which is going to eat up a lot of time. So I wanted to pick something that wasn't going to eat up as much time. But unfortunately, uh, it does look like this game is a bit harder. So it is going to eat up some of my time. At least to me, I don't know. Maybe if you grew up with this game, you're like, Average Joe, I don't know what you're talking about. This is one of the easiest games ever played. But for myself, incredibly challenging. But like I said, that's it for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe. I'm sure this will be a fun adventure. I think I'm going to name the episode like Welcome to the Jungle or something like that. But as always, until the next one, um, yeah, and then the schedule here. We'll be playing this series here on Mondays and Wednesdays. And Pokemon... Alpha Sapphire? Yeah, Alpha Sapphire, because it's Omega Ruby. Pokemon Alpha Sapphire on Tuesdays and Thursdays emulated. So lots of good Let's Plays coming out. Check out either of those if you're interested. Um, and yeah, we'll see y'all here on the next one, as always. And uh, peace out, Girl Scout. Take it easy. Thank <laughs> you.